Okay, so here's the uh, little extra I was I was talking about previously with the uh, with the task um, that I was asked for. Um, we talked about the division being able to enter it as uh, two digits and a letter at the same time. So I've got my input here. So I've just run it to show you what's going on. So the idea is I can enter one two a, which would be the same as saying one plus two, or I could enter. Uh, let's say uh, 1 3 uh, s which will be the same as 1 take away 3 and um, just prove that works so there we go minus 2 so the way it works is it's all down to um, the actual this feature here called character or char which is a um, which is a flow rhythm tool so when we're entering a string the first character string is zero, second character one, third character um, two. So as you, uh, I've declared a string. As I enter it, if I enter one two d, the one is at character position zero, the uh, the two is at index position um, one, and the next one is at index position two. So first of all, I'm checking for my um, position two, which is the letter. So if the letter that position is an A comes down here and my output then is I'm using another feature called two integer so there's your char my inputs that's the number one but it comes in as a string because we set it as a string so we convert that to be an integer and we add it because it's the a to the integer conversion of the next one so that will do one plus two in that particular example same here same here and the only difference is this is subtraction, this is multiplication, and this is division. So you can see the division. So, and then finally, if I've got no uh, no expression, so I'd run something that's wrong. So let's just run that to show what happens when something's wrong. So if I use an x for example, incorrect expression, or a lowercase a because they didn't check the lowercase a incorrect expression, but the capital A will give me the correct answer. And I've put the whole lot in a while loop just so I can keep. Uh, testing it. So this is a neat little feature. I say I wasn't sure what your your, your 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 tutor was asking for, but in this particular case, I'm taking in two numbers and a letter in one go. I'm separating them out, checking the first number, then the second number, and then the last letter from the 12a, and then performing that calculation on those. It's a little bit more complicated, but it might be something to show your lecturer or show your teacher to show that you're a uh, you're looking for new things, you try new ideas. So I hope that helps. All the best.